Star Trek Generations is a romp, in many ways like an old-fashioned Western. And there's no doubt who's wearing the white hat in this movie. It's Patrick Stewart playing Starship Commander Jean-Luc Picard. Warp one, engage! When I met the man, he seemed quite comfortable with the responsibility. I'd like to think of Picard being very much, say, in the mold of, of something like the, um, the Gary Cooper character in High Noon. Report. A quantum implosion has occurred within the Amagosa star. There's no doubt these filmmakers pulled off some dazzling movie magic. For instance, they turned this huge blue screen into an amazing computerized map of the galaxy. Dr. Great, more here, sir. And when Stewart has to pretend to be shocked by a protective shield in this scene, here's how it winds up on screen. But by far the most excitement generated by this movie is the meeting of starship captains Picard and Kirk. This is the first time these two legends have ever appeared on screen together. You have a duty. I don't need to be lectured by you. We had interviewed Shatner the day before, and now had a chance to see how Patrick would react to some of his co-star's thoughts. We asked William Shatner about passing the torch, and whether, in fact, he felt you passed the test. He doesn't have to pass. He's uh, Captain Kirk. He's Captain Picard now of the Enterprise. It's Freudian slip. Yeah, well, a Freudian slip, yeah. You'll cut that out, I'm sure. Oh, like hell you will. Oh, no, Bill, they didn't. <laughs> Captain of the Enterprise. Shatner told us one interesting tidbit about this scene. Underneath Patrick's uniform, he was wearing women's pantyhose. Patrick wanted to cross-dress. Uh, who was I to stop Patrick from wearing pantyhose? Sounds like fun. He came to me one day and said, you know, we're going to be, we're gonna be on these horses for two days. Uh, one of the best ways to prevent chafing is to wear pantyhose. And I said, uh, I, had, uh, I had no difficulty in embracing the woman in my personality, and I would be very happy to. He said, I just happened to have some in my trailer. I never raised the question how he happened to have several pairs of pantyhose in his trailer. In touch with his feminine side or not, there's no doubt that with a new generation of Star Trek movies seemingly in his future, Patrick Stewart will be a big screen hero for some time to come. Leonard Malton, Entertainment Tonight. And thanks to the gentlemen for sharing their intimate secrets. <laughs> Captain Picard and crew have inherited a movie franchise. The first six Star Trek films earned more than $470 million. Star Trek Generations opens around the country on Friday.